And hello folks, this is your old pal Uncle Al, we're doing another short one. One thing always I keep telling people, laws do not prevent crime. It just shows how sloppy or careless or out of date certain police force. This last month or earlier this month, 24 people died from knife wounds. Canada has a really strong anti-knife law. It failed, big time. Reason why? It didn't stop any of the crooks. No switchblade, no trench knives, none of that. All they did was went into people's houses and raid their kitchens. Okay, it's kind of stupid. All the blades they used, two guys, two brothers, and the other brother stabbed the other brother. They didn't need to get any kind of switchblade, knuckle knife, uh, what you might call it, cambit or anything. They just got it out of the kitchen door and killed 24 people and maimed, okay, up to 34 people. Seriously. Okay, I keep telling people, don't believe the media, especially the liberal Canadian media. CBC, Canadian Broadcasting Company. It's a bunch of hooey. Okay, the other thing I like to talk about is taxes. This year and last year, when Captain Crazy and crew got into office, we had a big increase in taxes. America pays more for taxes and energy than any other presidency in its entire history. Okay, more taxation, more uh, essential costs. Okay, that's inflation. Okay, and what does our stupid government does? Print more money. What other government other than Zimbabwe and the Weimar Weimar Republic of Germany did. They print more money. Okay, it's time to stop these boneheads. Okay, simple, clear. I hope you can hear me. All right, this is common sense. That's the title down below. Common sense. Uncle Al chats common sense. So what you want to do is to go everything for the last 10 years and get rid of it, okay? A lot of these laws are stupid laws. A lot of these politicians are idiots and you've got to stop voting them in. Now, I keep telling people, I just put out on my community posts about the Irish Civil War. Well, they didn't like certain people, didn't keep their promises and raise taxes and was a lot worse than before. What happened? Some groups went underground and started PAs, political assassinations, okay? Because they know the crooked politicians. A lot of these politicians were, oh, did they got shot? No, they got strangled. They were garroted. Or let's go to the kitchen drawer, okay? No gunfire yet. Gunfire came later when they went after crooked cops and crooked military. People had enough, okay? Before this starts, let's do something fairly simple. Get rid of taxes, okay? Can you see that? Taxes. Let's get rid of it. Get rid of unneeded taxes, like the gas tax in California, okay? That solves half the problem for the state's economy. Without that tax, we will be back in the red. With that tax, oh, it pays a lot of things, like Proposition 26 and 27. No, it doesn't help the homeless or the Indians. No, or the mentally ill. It's all a lie. Okay, vote no on both of them. Go after it, study the problem, common sense again, and go after all these organizations. Only ones making money out of it is FanDuel and the other guys. 
Okay, common sense time. Use your head. And I'll be seeing you. I have a little bits and pieces. Bye now. And also check out my community board. All right. Prepping my face this afternoon has a really good one. I think at 3. 3 uh, p.m. today. That's Pacific Standard Time. So check it out. I'll be seeing you. I'll be seeing you folks. I don't want to barf on the screen. I'll be seeing you. You have a nice day now. Bye now.